Hello friends, in this video on Amines part 3 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Now we'll talk about the classification of amines. Amines are classified as 1, 2 and 3 degree. So the amines are classified as either primary or secondary or tertiary depending on what depending on the number of hydrogens that are replaced by alkyl or aryl group in ammonia as i told amines are nothing but derivatives of ammonia so you have you have ammonia here so you replace one hydrogen only with alkyl or aryl group you call it primary amine you replace two hydrogen with alkyl or aryl group we call it secondary amine you replace three hydrogen you call it tertiary amine so if you see the structure so in this case how many hydrogens we have replaced so if you see only one hydrogen we have replaced so this is what this is primary amine in this case how many hydrogen we have replaced one hydrogen we have replaced here one hydrogen because the typical structure of this compound which i'm showing you is it was something like this correct you can draw the waste one if you want yeah. correct this was the structure now if you compare this structure and this structure you see that only one of the hydrogen is replaced so this is primary amine so if you compare this structure and this structure you see that two of the hydrogen is replaced this is secondary amine. You compare this structure with this structure, you'll see that all three hydrogens are replaced. So this is nothing but my tertiary amine. Right? Hope you understand. If you replace one hydrogen, this becomes primary amine. If you have only one alkyl group and two hydrogen. You replace two hydrogens, you get secondary amine. You replace three hydrogen, you get tertiary amine. A lot of students get confused here with the number of hydrogens. Don't count on, on the number of hydrogens you have in the amine. Just see the number of hydrogens. You have to think of the base ammonia and then only you can you know, tell whether it is primary amine or secondary amine, tertiary amine. Let's take one numerical on, on the classification of amines as primary, secondary, and tertiary. You have to classify. So to do this, our base has to be ammonia. So let's start with ammonia here, NH3. So let's see in this compound how many hydrogen is replaced. If you see here, only one hydrogen is replaced with this bulky aryl group. So since only one hydrogen is replaced here, this is my one degree one. Let's see this here. Again, let's start with ammonia. So here, if you see one, this is replaced with hydrogen. So if you see here, here also both this hydrogen is replaced, correct, with CS3 because there are two CS3 group attached to this nitrogen. So it's all this hydrogen is replaced, so this is 3 degree amine. Let's see this. Let's again start with NH3. So here we see in this NH3, one particular hydrogen is replaced and these two hydrogens are intact. So only one hydrogen is replaced. So it is one degree. Let's see this. So here if you see, there are two C2H5 group attached to nitrogen. That means two of the hydrogen is replaced, one hydrogen is intact. Since two hydrogen is replaced, this is two degree amine. Hope you understand. If you want to find whether it's primary, secondary, or tertiary, it is best to first draw ammonia because amines are derived from ammonia and then see how many hydrogen is replaced. So in this case, we saw that one hydrogen was replaced. So it is called primary amine. So in this case, we saw that there were two, three hydrogens were replaced, tertiary amine. Here also only one hydrogen was replaced, two hydrogens are intact. Again, primary amine. So in this case, two hydrogens were replaced, one hydrogen is intact. So this is also my secondary amine. Let's classify amines as simple and mixed amines. So amines are called simple when the alkyl or the aryl group that are attached to this nitrogen, they are same. So if they are same, this is the keyword here, please note. If they are same, they are called amine, uh, simple amine. 
and if they are not same they are called mixed amine please note you have to ignore hydrogen don't even think of hydrogen for example in this case don't think saying don't say that this is ammonia this is hydrogen this, this has to be mixed no hydrogen just ignore now if you ignore hydrogen you have two methyl group attached to this this is my simple amine here all three are ammonia sorry methyl so they are also my simple amines correct now if we talk about mixed amine here ignore hydrogen and if you see here one is methyl one is ethyl so this is my mixed amine so this is my mixed and these two are my simple correct this is my mixed amine simple amine thank you visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality education videos you can also attempt free online tests that are there in our website you can also get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website thanks a lot for watching